Hi guys, I'm here with Minnie Lou to show you how to put together one of the cute baskets that we currently have in the shop. We have a lot of different baskets and they're all built basically the same ways. Um, there is a different video for the weave basket, so if you are looking for that, look for the weave basket tutorial. But this is our basic basket and they all look different but they're built basically the same way. So many cute designs. I am gonna show you how to put together the bow on this one first because that is a completely separate thing. So let me just show you that really quick. So you're going to get pieces that look like this. So all you're going to do is hand press this side in on that side and then hand press just because you want that little bow feature just like that see how that is and then I like to use hot glue just to get it in there really quick to glue that in paste because you need so very little glue to make that go down Okay, and then you're going to glue the back of this and you can decide which side. I'm going to do this side because that's where my, um, where I folded it in, right to the back of that. Okay, and then for the center piece, you're going to glue this into the center and then I like to press down once it's glued on, which is difficult to do in this situation. I'm going to show you right here on this one how that works. You can see I just glued it down and then I pressed it down on either side on this one. Okay, so that's how to put together the bow. Now for a basket and many of the baskets also have flowers. So I'm going to start by putting together the handle and I actually like to use stick glue for this because it's a little more bendable than the hot glue. The hot glue doesn't really hold as well. So we're just gonna start by putting the handle together and not all of them have like an extra handle piece. This is more decorative than anything. Let that dry for a second. And then we're just going to fold up all of the basket pieces. And then you should have flaps. These are your glue tabs on either side of the basket. Now this I'm going to use hot glue for because it, it just comes together so quick. Just like that. And some are straight and some have this outward basket edge. These make the most adorable favor boxes or Easter, like mini Easter baskets or Valentine's Day baskets, basically any holiday, just change up the colors. There's also some different themes in the shop that are super cute. All right, just like that. All right, once you have that base together, and you can see it came together pretty quick, some of the different baskets have accent pieces on the outside, so you would just glue those down now, or you could glue them down before you put the basket together. I'm just going to put the handle on. So I'm just going to glue it on each side. I like just a tiny little bit of glue right here on the edge. Glue it to the center, just like that. I love this iridescent paper. And then I'm going to put a little more glue on this side and glue that right there. Okay, pretty simple. That's your basic basket. So some of them are gonna have flowers and I just wanted to show you how I went about with the flowers. So with these, these don't have centers because I expect you to put some kind of fun gem or something else in the center of them. I think I'm gonna put gems on mine, just sticky gems from the store. So I just wanted to show you how to finger press them. You can see I just went around to every single petal. And then same thing with the leaves. I'm just gonna put a little crease in them just to make them pop a little bit here. Today I'm going to use these little pearls. They're like just little pop, pop outs and they're like, they already have a sticker on them. So they're super easy and I think so pretty. Okay, once those are done, I'm just going to add these and I actually think I'm gonna start right here at the handle 
and start just gluing them in. I love the organic process of actually putting on the flowers. And one more leaf. And listen, if you wanted to do along all the edges, you absolutely could, and you could add more. But that is done. You could do one like that side, that side. I kind of actually like having a couple of different options there for you to see. All right, make sure and subscribe to the channel if you want to get more mini-loo tutorials of all the great kids stuff that we do.